if you are looking forward for getting the Canadian PR through express entry or PNP program, there cannot be a better exam than this CELPIP exam. CELPIP is alternate exam in India and it is an exam which is far easier than your IELTS exam and you can get easy PR through this exam, CELPIP exam. Today we were going through the details of this exam. First of all, it is a Canadian exam and it is being conducted right now in 19 countries. Starting with Canada, it is available in USA, Philippines, UAE, Singapore, China, India, Korea, Japan, Nigeria, Bangladesh, Kuwait, Saudi Arabia, Pakistan, Sri Lanka, Qatar, Nepal, Australia, and UK. So these are the 19 countries where this exam is available. This exam was introduced in India in September 2019 with one center only, that was Chandigarh. And tentatively, it is a four-year-old exam in India. And last four years, it is a majorly a COVID-affected time. Somehow, despite the COVID-affected time, this exam has gone so much of popularity in India. That exam center has gone right now in nine cities. So nine cities, you can have the self exam center where you can book the self exam and by personally visiting the exam center, you can appear the self exam in India. So these centers are available in, like started with Chandigarh, you can appear in New Delhi, Rugram, Chennai, Ahmedabad, Mumbai, Hyderabad, Bangalore, and Calcutta. So these are the nine cities where you can appear this self exam. So this exam is, a, first of all, is a computer-based exam. As we know, IELTS exam happened to be a pen, paper, and computer-based exam, but this exam is a only a computer-based exam. And we better know IELTS happened to be a two-sitting exam. You are required to go a separate day and separate exam center for your speaking test. And rest three model, you have to go for another center and another day. So that IELTS exam is a two-day exam, but self is a one-day exam. All these four models happen to be a, in this exams are two, reading, writing, listening, speaking. Because self is none other than a, your English proficiency test. So they are just taking your proficiency through these four models, reading, writing, listening, speaking. And all this happen in a one go in three hours. So your a complete exam is finished in three hours and that to a one stretch and one go. You need not to go for another exam center or another day for appearing the speaking test. It happened to be a on computer itself. And it is your speaking is recorded to the computer, that's all. And the best part of self is that within five days, you receive the result also. So that is possible through this self exam. Moreover, when you are just booking for this self exam, immediately dates are available. So otherwise, when we prepared for the IELTS exam and we go for the test booking date, in case of IELTS, we have to wait for at least two to three weeks minimum to get the actual exam date to appear. Whereas self within a same week or within a two, three days, you can get the date and you can appear the exam. And then within the five days, you get the your result also. And moreover, it is acceptable to that particular country, Canada, because it is a Canadian exam. And the various immigration categories, it is applicable and accepted to all the immigration categories, like PNP program, Express Entry, Federal Skill Worker program, Federal Skill Trade Program, Startup Visa Programs, and CEC class, Canadian Experience class, and you can utilize in the study purposes also for under the SDS category. So this exam is a acceptable for your study visa also under the SDS category. In IELTS, there are two type of exam. One is general, another is academic. But in this exam, only one exam, that is a, you can call it as a general, and that exam itself applicable for both the categories. Like you can utilize for the uh, immigration purposes or you can utilize for the study purpose also. That is also the best part. Now, the, as far as the, the exam cost is concerned, it is cheaper than your IELTS exam. Like cost of this exam in India is 12,800 right now, including taxes. Whereas the IELTS exam, right now the cost is 16,200. So tentatively 3,500 this exam is economical than your IELTS exam. And as far as the study material is concerned, you can get study material from the official website of self -help. Somehow, otherwise, we are the one of the official channel partner in India of selling. And you can find the, our name in the list of India, India partner to the self -help website. And then we are the one of the official partner in India. And then we are providing the own sort of resources to the candidate 
including training with offline and online mode. And moreover, this exam is most preferred exam over IELTS exam. The reason being that it is carrying the lot of features in this exam which are supporting to the candidate to get the higher score. You know, when you are applying for the Canadian PR, that English proficiency is carrying the most weightage out of it. You know, there are four factors. One is your education qualification, another is your age factor, another third one is your work experience, and fourth is your English proficiency. All these four put together became your CRS score. That is called as the comprehensive rating score. And that comprehensive rating score is the decided factor when you are just applying for the, your PR. So not only the candidate from India apply for the Canadian PR, from other countries are apply for the Canadian PR, and they are all just evaluated on the basis of that CRS score. Higher the CRS score, better would be the chances of getting your selection in the PR procedure. So when you can get the higher, higher CRS score, because at given moment of time, you better know that your education qualification is constant at moment you are applying for. So your education qualification is constant. Your age factor is constant at, uh, when you are applying. And third one is your work experience is also constant whenever you are applying for the PR. So you can't change these three factors, but somehow you can better change the one factor that is in your hand and it is a, your English proficiency score. And in fact, this English proficiency score affects the, all the score of other three factors also. So it is the most important factor in Canadian PR and that English proficiency score is easy to score through this self paper exam because it is carrying a lot of benefit to the candidate in writing, in reading, in speaking, and listening, all four models. There are various pro-candidate supporting features in this exam. Therefore, this exam is becoming a more and more popular in this country, not in India, but all over the world also. It is getting a more popularity. Now, the validity of this score is two years from the test date. So within two years, you can utilize the self paper score for your immigration purposes or you can utilize for the study purpose also because it is a dual purpose exam. So that way you can have the better chance to use this score in both the categories. And moreover, the, the, I told you that all the four models which are there in this exam are similar to the IELTS exam, but this score model happened to be a one by one in three hours and you completed the entire exam in three hours. And that the format of this exam is that listing model is this exam is that listing model is carrying the six part and then each model is carrying the number of questions. That way it is there are a 30 question in your listing model. And you know IELTS it happened to be a 40, 40 question. So it has a 38 question for IELTS is having 40 questions. And somehow the in speaking, there are eight parts, every part containing one question only. That way you are having only eight questions in speaking. Somehow, otherwise, the IELTS is having up to 20 questions in speaking. Moreover, the third one is the reading part. And that reading part is carrying the four parts. And each part is carrying the, again, number of questions. That makes, again, 38 questions in your reading too. Whereas the IELTS is having, again, the 40 questions in reading. Right is carrying the two parts, one part, part one and part two. Part one, you have to write as email. And then part two, you have to write a simple passage. So this is the broad format of your self paper exam and it is completed in within three hours of duration and within five days you receive the result also. Moreover, this exam is, like I told you, it is happened to be a way in Canadian spoken English. So Canadian spoken English is easy to understand in comparison to British and American spoken English, which are there, the medium for your IELTS exam. So that is another advantage in this exam, that this spoken English Canadian, we just can understand far, far easier than the American and then British spoken English. So somehow this was the general parameter, the general uh, information about the self paper exam. And if you have the, any query or any question, just mention in the chat box, we will be replying you. And if you are interested for getting the all sorts of support, like study material, training part, online and offline work, so just call us on the number displaying on the screen. And if this video is useful, then I would request you to subscribe and then just forward to whom you concerned that it would be useful and like the video. And 
we would be meeting in the another video till then goodbye thank you so much bye bye